good with me, Kimberly. Welcome to Deal or Good, Deal or Good, Deal or Good. Welcome to Deal or Good with me, Kimberly. Welcome to Deal or Good, Deal or Good, Deal or Good. Welcome to Deal or Good with me, Kimberly. Welcome to Deal or Good, Deal or Good, Deal or Good. Welcome to Deal or Good with me, Kimberly. This is the live where I show you how something caught my eye and it made me click by now. Sometimes it's really good, sometimes it's really whack. Most times I keep it, but sometimes I gotta send it back. Maybe it's just too big, maybe it's just too small. Sometimes it doesn't do what I thought it would at all. Sometimes it's just okay, I mean I'm not in love. Which is why I welcome you to watch Deal or Good. Welcome to Deal or Good, Deal or Good, Deal or Good. you how something caught my eye and it made me click by now sometimes it's really good sometimes it's really whack most times I keep it but sometimes I gotta send it back maybe it's just too big maybe it's just too small sometimes it doesn't do what I thought it would at all sometimes it's just okay I mean I'm not impressed maybe it doesn't even pass my sleeve test and let me say this too sometimes you'll take too long you go to get the deal and the deal then go welcome to deal Deal or good, deal or good, deal or good. Welcome to Deal or Good with me, Kimberly. Welcome to Deal or Good, Deal or Good, Deal or Good. Welcome to Deal or Good with me, Kimberly. Now with your Amazon order, I hope you are pleased. But if you're not, y'all, please don't contact me. Here's the thing that you really, really need to do. Just contact Amazon and let them take care of you. Because they take returns, they'll give you back your money. You're telling me when I can't do a thing for you, honey. No, because I don't work for them. And they don't work for me. And taking care of you is their responsibility. Because I'm like you. I'm a customer too. And I use the same deals, promo codes that you do. And I don't make the codes, so I don't take requests. And you should read reviews because that's what's going to serve you best. I don't control the prices or the shipping time. I try to make sure everything that I show is prime. And let me say this too, I hope I'm being really clear. I do appreciate the fact that you are even here. And I forgot what I'm supposed to say because Dallas is singing the right way. And if you don't mind, one more thing to say. I forgot, please follow. <laughs> Y'all, with Ella be back here just flowing and, and all of that, it, it make my brain confused because then I start thinking, dang, she is singing. And then I'm like, what come next? I almost got to do my end part all over again. All right, let me think. Well, let me, can, you back, can you back me up just a little bit? Because it's important for me to say this to you. Hello, Soraysha. Soraysha? Soraysha? I'm sorry. I'm, I know I'm messing it all up. You have to get that all the time. Thank you uh, so much, girl. This ain't improv. This is uh, this is practice. This is practice. Hold on, hold on. This just for you, Seraysha. Just for Seraysha. Okay, let's see. I don't forget. I, I'm all thrown off. I can't even do it. But thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in. Um, let me say this too. I hope I'm being really clear. I do appreciate the fact that you are even here because there are many lives where you could choose to be. And so I'm grateful that you choose to be here with me. And just one more thing. I got a lot of things to show. So could you please just click follow? Ooh, ooh. When I ask to follow, it's not down there. It's up to your right. Oh, okay. Hold on. All right. Let me say it again. All right. Uh, what else? Where I started? 
where I started. I really appreciate that you were here. No, not yet. Oh. And let me say this too. I hope I'm being really clear. I do appreciate the fact that you were even here because there are many lives where you could choose to be. And so I'm grateful that you choose to be here with me. And just one more thing. I got a lot of things to show. So before I start, could you please click follow? Is this way? Is this way? I hope I hope I got it right. I hope I'm not pointing like this is my this is I'm probably pointing to the left for y'all. Wait, this is my right. Please click follow, 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 follow this way. All right. Thank you for following. <laughs> All right. So welcome to this episode of Deal or the Deal or the Deal Deal or the. She threw in some extra stuff tonight that I won't prepare for, and it just threw me all off. You know, one day I'm going to get used to my background singer. All right, so y'all know I always start the show. Hold on. Here go Boo Jank. Invisible Boo Jank. Hey, Boo. He back there looking all handsome like he always is. Yes, girl. Yes. Ella Reese be back here jamming, singing, and all of that. If I could sing. I was singing the whole show. Here's what I got to show you next. And look at this, what I just got. And y'all would be, mm mm, stick to your day job. Okay, here's Invisible Boo Jank. Whenever I do deal or dud, he takes me on a date. Hello, Boo. I ain't talked to him all day. Hello, Boo. Thank you. You look handsome too. Okay, yeah. All right, so as in our custom, when I do deal or dud, Invisible Boo Jank always takes me out. And you get to select where we shall go based upon what I have on tonight. So let's get started with tonight's outfit, a mixture of casual and classy. Why should I always start my music all early? I ain't even up yet. Okay, back my music up, back my music up. Here's my outfit for the night. Give me some volume on that. Peculiar to me, not really peculiar, but I just wasn't prepared for 
this when I bought it. As you can see, the bib part of this, it does not come up very high. So I think this one, um, I don't want to hitch it up any higher because then it's not going to fit me good down here. First, let me tell you about the fit. So I ordered a size large and I wear about a size 11 and a half. You know, I'm on my way to a 10, but not quite there yet. The stretch in these feel amazing. So when I took them out the pack, I was a little bit concerned, you know, because sometimes you don't know how jeans are going to play out. You get a pair of jeans and it's just not what you thought it was going to be. But these have really good stretch in them. I feel like if my knees would let me, I could just drop it like it's hot. But my knees was like, no, you're not. You're not doing that. Mm -mm. You're not doing that. Okay, so I really do like it. Now, I thought that I ordered the distressed pair, but these are the ones that came. And sometimes I'm just ordering things so quickly that I don't know, maybe I'm just not as mindful as I need to be. But I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay with this. It does have back pockets. They're shallow. They're shallow pockets, so maybe not suitable for your phone. But it does have back pockets, and you see it's, it's narrow up in here. Mm -hmm. Come on, Jane. strap called that you can you know fold it up and button it right there I forget what that is where I was well, that that won't me I was I was mocking I was mocking Boojang he was back there you know getting his robot on he was that was that was him that was doing all of that I didn't want to leave him by himself because you know if you're just out there doing it by yourself you look kind of crazy so I had to get with him on that okay this is my dance right here knees ain't gonna let me do too much anyway the, the shirt is just a plain white collared button down the front hits me about right here which is an appropriate length if you like to pair a white shirt with the jeans you can get some coverage in the back if your jeans have slippage of course this is not the outfit that I have on tonight that's gonna be slipping because it's being held up by the farmer in the Dale straps but I love this detailing here I've always liked shirts like this from the time that I was a child. I just thought it was the, the best thing ever to be able to roll your sleeve and then button it up. So we know that shirts come like that all the time now. And that is one of my favorites. All right, now the shoe. The shoe. The shoe is a glitter, gold glitter strap heel. Something very comfortable. Casual yet dressy. Of course, you can wear this particular shoe with a number of things. I'm going to take it off for you and show it to you up close. The one that is in the carousel is by Dream Paris. And so you can take a look at that. I will give you the close up of it right here. Un momento, por favor. Let me take it off my foot. Mm -hmm. So this is the shoe here. Yes, look at that gold glitter now this one is uh by a different brand but i found you one that is comparable if you'd like to shop the look so gold glitter band there give you a little bit of bling and a little bit of pop there and on the back nice little strap here i love this detailing here that just comes up above the strap just a little bit and on the one that is in the carousel, in the carousel, in the carousel, in the carousel, I'm not sure where the carousel shows for you tonight. Um, you see that it, it, it does wrap around and um, is attached to the back of the shoe. So this is the shoe that I'm rocking tonight for my look. Continuing the look, y'all know we all about the pearls these days these days all right so i have on the flapper pearls the 1920 
flapper pearls. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Just a simple, long, elongated. I'm not going to put it on. Thank you. A simple, elongated strand of pearls. I have these tied into a knot, but to enhance my outfit a little bit and get my pearl long. Y'all know we've been bracing pearls in these days, pearls and chucks. Um, that is the pearl necklace. It is also in the carousel. Again, if you want to shop the look, we know that pearls give you a very classy, classic look. And pearls, you can dress them up. You can dress them down. You can make them level to the ground if you want to. And they always just come off so classy. Additionally, with that, I am also wearing on my wrist a... Uh, pearl bracelet to you know just bring the whole ensemble together you know like that and put my hands in my pocket a little bit and took my shoe off so put my hand in my pocket a little bit and just pop a pearl right there to give you some some casual and some dress up at the same time you gotta keep them guessing all right they don't know which which angle you're gonna hit them from whether you're gonna put on your chucks with this and your pearls or put on your heels with this and your pearls but either way you're gonna rock it and you're gonna look amazing so that is the pearl bracelet that i am wearing with this tonight okay it is in the carousel again if you'd like to shop the look i saw a girl a young lady with this outfit on and I was just so inspired. I was like, dang, she looks really good. I really like that outfit. And so I just decided to, you know, get a little bit of her style going. Mm-hmm. I don't know if I just made it too dark in here. Mm -hmm. I did. Mm -hmm. I made it too dark. Mm -hmm. Y'all can't see me no more. All right. It was just giving me a whole lot of glare. The earrings, you all. Let me take this one off. The earrings are actually a part of a set that I've shown you before. This was a 38 piece jewelry set. So there's 38 pieces of jewelry from earrings to necklaces to rings. It came in this bag here. This is just a, let me take it off so you can see it up close. It's just a pearl hoop. It's just a simple pearl hoop. It is on gold wiring which is fine with me. I, I think I prefer silver, but it is on gold wiring. Just a little simple, you know. Again, continue the class, continue the class. Y'all here for me, y'all here? Thank you for that compliment. So, please tell me how to say your name, Sor Soratia. I wanna say Sor Soratia, I'm sorry. I'm ashamed to try to say I, I'm sorry. Can you please forgive me for saying your name all kind of crazy? I think I need more time to try to figure it out phonetically in my mind. All right, but anyway, here is the um, earrings. And the earrings actually came out of this set. And again, I've shown this set before. So it came off of this card here. But you see on this card, there are some studs. There are some pearls, gold studs, gold uh, and pearl studs. And then this gold and pearl mix here of a hoop these were actually on that particular card you'll see the pricing in the carousel just in case you're wondering the price and then we have uh, more earrings here the tassel earrings which are fun that's what people be saying fun i'm gonna say which are um in style right now i don't want to say fun how is an earring fun where I get that from? Okay. So this is another set of earrings that came in the packet. So studs and then some uh, hoops and tassels. Additionally, all kind of stuff. This one is a, uh, a couple of shells, cowrie shells, seashells, starfish, and again, gold studs. So you got options, you got options when you try, with this particular item, when you're trying to match things up to your outfit and all of that, you have all kind of options in this one packet, 38 pieces. Now, of course, we're not talking about fine jewelry. This is um custom, custom. that's not fashion. That's the word I was looking for. This is fashion jewelry. A little bracelet here, put it on your wrist with your little summer beach outfit and enjoy the fun in the sun. 
these are some 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 diamond like diamond like earrings you know you're not gonna get no no real earrings out this out the package look at the price look at the price you know what I mean? okay I, I didn't think you knew anybody that was gonna give you some some diamonds for that price now some of them are missing because i've worn some on some other packages but there's a wide variety of accessories in this one little pack so it's great for versatility now this particular packet i'm not going to open it all up because there's some some bracelets and, and chains and things and it'll take me a minute to get them untangled for you you even got a little bobby pin if you got more hair than i do i can't do nothing with that right there but pin it on my clothes or something i can't can't do nothing with this right here but i'm sure you could um and then there's some rings a couple of rings that come in the pack again silver is is the color my color of choice but these things are in there uh, for you now there is no silver in this particular package but they might have another one I'm not sure if if, if they have a different um, pack that you can pick up that um, offers a silver tone no this one is just all of the gold tone if you click on the item in the carousel you can see all of the other items that are still included in here there's a little hair pin up you know pin your hair back pin your hair pin your hair back if you need help pinning your hair i um i don't need that i don't know what i'm gonna do with this wait till one of the children come over and you know let me if they let me play in their hair so all kind of little hoops and rings and pearls and things and necklaces and hair clips and barrettes and all of that in this one packet offering you lots of versatility. Again, the price is in the carousel. It's a little bit um, it's a little bit decreased price at the time of this live. I know you can see it for yourself, so I shan't call it out to you. And then let's talk about the purse, y'all. My purse for the evening is the $10,000 money bag. So those of you who are aspiring to be a millionaire and you need to keep some kind of vision in front of you, you know, to uh, keep the vision in front of you. Put stuff in front of you. You know, people make vision boards when they have goals. So if, you're, if your goal is around this right here, go on and get you a stack. I love this, this little sparkly bag. And of course, it matches the shoe a little bit. <clears throat> sparkle in the bag. For the sparkle in the shoe, you know, bring those two elements together. So this bag is, it says $100 bill, but it's a stack. Y'all see the stack? The stack amount, a band. What's this called? A band? Mm -hmm. All right, it's a band. Ten thousand dollars. That's a band. All right. So I love this this little clutch here. It has the this kind of closure, clasp closure. Got to get up on my fashion. I'm trying to describe stuff to y'all, and I got to try to figure out the word at the same time. It does have a gold shoulder chain here. Let me just back up with my one shoe. It does have a gold shoulder chain. So you can, you know, hang it on your shoulder, put your hands in your pocket, go strolling down the street. What's my, give me my, my stroll music. A short chain so if you want to wear it from your shoulder you're able to do that y'all see how I hit that slow-mo like they be doing on TikTok and stuff yeah I'm, I'm working on that I'm working on that all right and then it also has a short chain so if you want to shorten it up a little bit and wear it you know right up under your arm you are able to do that too now my favorite way to carry this bag is just how I did for you when I was showing you the outfit I just simply had it in my hand I just want to carry it like this 
Now, maybe if I was shopping or something or whatever, I might want to, you know, secure, secure it a little bit with the short chain. But I just like it in my hand like this. Boom, 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 mm, 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 mm. All right, so that is this bag. Again, it is in the carousel if you want to pick it up. Maybe this bag is not your style to carry around, but it certainly makes for a good vision board. Don't y'all think so? Shake my head and swing that hair. Mm-hmm. Yeah, girl. That's about all the hair swinging I can do. All right. So I love, love, love the bag. If you'd like to get it, it is in the carousel. Um, and I have this, like, this generally just sits on my desk. I don't think I've taken it anywhere quite yet, but this sits on my desk in front of me because sometimes you have to write the vision and you make it plain and you put it before you so you can see it all the time. Whatever your vision and your goal is, it might not be centered around this. It might be centered around some other things. Write it down and put it in your sight. Put it in your sight so you can't help but to look at this. And when you look at this, it's, it's when you see your vision that inspires you to keep going towards that thing. That's your little, that's your little lesson for the day. All right, all right. I'm gonna move on. I'm gonna move on, man. Move on to my next item. Mm -hmm. All right. So y'all, <laughs> thank you, Nando. So. On my last live, I showed you this sweater that I got is in the carousel right now. I love, love, love this sweater. And for the price, I just could not beat it. And so I loved it so much. I had it on. If you look at the previous live, I just had it on with a pair of distressed jeans. It passed my sleeve test. It came past the watch. It hit my hand like I would like for my sweater to hit my hand. And so I was so excited about it that I bought some more. Okay, I went back and bought every color that they had available in my size. So here is the black one. It's Christmas, it's Christmas. All right, so here is the black sweater and I'm just gonna back up a little bit so you can see it. First, I'm gonna show it up close so you can see like the knit pattern. Mm-hmm. It has the rolled, uh, rolled hem. It has it on the sleeve. It has it at the neck. The neckline is also rolled and the bottom hemline is also rolled. And so it's just a very nice casual, sweater you probably could dress it up a little bit depending on what you're wearing what you have on i still got one shoe on y'all why well, ain't take the other shoe off the one gold shoe sitting over there the other one over here on my foot okay i'll get it thank you though i have the best executive producer so y'all this is the black sweater i uh, i have long arms and I was very, very pleased with the sleeve test of the white one. So again, I got the, the black one. Don't the black one look good against these jeans right here? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. All right, I could dance all day, y'all admiring myself, but I won't put you through that. I won't put you through that. I'm just gonna say this comes in black, it comes in white, it comes in pink, it comes in army green and it comes in burgundy. The color that they did not have in my size was the army green. Thank you. So I went on and got the other four colors. I started with the white one and immediately after wearing the white one, I went back and got the black one, the pink one. They are soft. They are not um, super thick sweaters. So if you wanna wear them into the springtime, you would be able to do that. Again, look at that sleeve, y'all. I don't have it on, but I know when I can do like this and hold the sleeve with my fingers, I know it's gonna pass my sleeve test. Okay, so this is the pink one. It's like a baby pink. Mm-hmm, somebody baby daughter. That's so cute. Yes, and it's soft, it feels good, it's not too heavy, and it's not too light. So it's perfect for this kind of weather. If I was going to wear it right now, I would put on something underneath it like a camisole or something that's up against my skin, but as it warms up, you won't uh, so much need that. Okay, and then I got the burgundy one. Yes, I'm here for it. Look at the price, y'all. Look at the price. You can't beat that price. So this is uh this is doing it for me. This is the color of the burgundy one. Again, you see the same uh, knit pattern. I don't know what that particular style is, that particular slit stitch is. 
past the sleeve test from the shoulder to my fingertips. Yes, I am here for it. Hopefully you like it. Again, it comes in white, it comes in black, it comes in army green. They have my, my, my size in that one. It comes in pink and it comes in this wine color. So that is the Hill Tichu Women's Casual Scoop Net Knit Sweater Fall Long Sleeve Pullover Top. Go and grab it. Now, I did, un momento, por favor. Let me take this, this other gold heel off so I don't have to be hobbling back and forth because I have another sweater to, to show you. And Penelope is here tonight. Have y'all met Penelope? Put in the comments if you've met Penelope or not because she is here tonight. You're welcome, Nando. Go ahead and, and keep reminded about your goals. Like that is so, 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 so important. Many times we set goals at the beginning of the year or whenever, and then they just kind of fall out of our mind because we don't have anything in front of us to keep us reminded of that goal and to keep us moving forward towards that goal. So whatever that goal is, put it in front of your face. Put it somewhere, post it up somewhere where you're gonna see it all the time. All right, so this other sweater that I got, y'all, check this sweater out. I thought it was a lovely sweater. Just if you're looking in the carousel, 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 you see that it is the Aleli, uh, Aleli. I don't like when people be making me um, feel like I can't read. I can't read, but they be coming with these these names that I don't know how to pronounce. The woman's open front cardigan. So it came, um, did this come today? I think this came, yes, this came, no, it came yesterday. It came a couple days ago. I'm just taking it out of the pack, so I don't know what it looked like, how it fit, if it passed my sleeve test. It does feel uh, fairly soft. Um, it looks a little bit, the yarn looks a little bit smushed. Like, um, you know how you put something in a one of those bags that just kind of vacuums out the air out of everything and then it kind of just has this flat uh, shrink wrapped kind of look. That's how it's looking as I pull it out of the package. You probably can't see that detail, but I can. Like it needs to just be fluffed up or it needs to breathe for a minute and get some, some air into the fibers. But let's, let's keep it going, let's keep it going see what it, what we got here i'm gonna back up and put it on for you this is what it's looking like right now it's looking pretty promising right now let's see don't 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 what y'all think been in the closet for a minute but that's okay we can freeze it or throw it in the dryer or something i love the length of it i love the length it has pockets on both sides hold on sleeve check sleeve check look at the sleeves it passes by my jewelry and hits my hand that's perfect for me this is the other other side it passed by my jewelry and this this thing this size seems just a little bit shorter. I don't know if it's okay, there it goes. So it passed by my jewelry and hits my hand. Black, yellow, gray, light blue. Again, I think it's a nice compliment to even what I'm wearing tonight. Now I would take the pearls off with this. I wouldn't rock the pearls with this. I would go something that's a little bit more casual, like a t-shirt up under here, and a nice little tote bag. Let me just grab this one because it's nearby. All right, nice little tote bag like that. And maybe this is the outfit that you put the chucks on with or a sneaker or something like that to round out the look. But I am liking the sweater. I mean, I expected to like it. Hold on now, hold on. Is it, is it a little bit off? Hold on, let's see. I'm, I'm trying to decide right here, do these lines match up? A momento. You know how you try on clothes at the store when you was a little kid and then you go in the dressing room, your mama tell you to go try something on and you go in the dressing room and then you just put it on, then you be coming out, coming out the dressing room like that. And stand in front of your mama. 
that she, well, this was my mama. You can't fit your clothes no better than that. And then, so then you try to fix it, and then, you know, you end up like that. You all nervous and stuff because she fussing at you. And then your shoulders be up to your ears. Yeah, okay. That was just me. Was that just me that had that experience? Okay, so I like the sweater. I love it. I like it. Some denim. Mm -hmm. My little Starbucks cup. Where's... Can y'all tell I like bling? Can y'all tell just a little bit that I, I like bling? All right, got my little Starbucks cup right here. Okay, where we going? Mm -hmm. We're going somewhere nice and casual with this sweater. Well, I'm loving this sweater. What you think? Really nice. nice. Yeah. I like it. That's what for sure you right on. For sure you right on? Mm -hmm. The length is good. I could probably wear these with some leggings yeah. and not have to worry about, some you know, hoops. being overexposed with my figure because everybody don't deserve that. Everybody don't deserve every. You can't show everything to everybody. All right. So this is a deal. This is a deal for me. This is a deal. It's nice and lightweight. Um, you know, I got, let me just show you like this so you can see that it's made like this. So it's not a very thick yarn. You can see my hand through it. So you're not going to burn up in it. It's just something to knock the chill off. Hold on. Let me fold my arms. Yes, ma'am. Yes, Gabe. All right, I'm here for it. I like it. It is in the carousel for you right now. Okay, we are gonna get on to Penelope. She is here tonight. She haven't been on the show in a while, but you know she has said something to me about it not too long ago. How come y'all let me be on the show no more? And I was like, because because you be acting out and stuff. When you get on the show, you be acting out, and I can't have that. You acting all out on the live, and then we got it. Anyway, let me tell y'all what Penelope got on. I'm going to let Penelope use my, my fashion music, okay? She know I don't be doing that. I got my own song. She need to find her own. But we're going to let her walk tonight to my music. All right, here go what Penelope is showing y'all tonight. Penelope, come on here. Come on here. This Penelope, y'all, she be thinking she grown. Back her up a little bit so you can see the length of her garment. Okay, so Penelope is wearing this white off shoulder, very summery, very cute dress. Now, let me just say this about Penelope Penelope is not my size. She be trying to wear my clothes, but she is not my size. She does not have all of these curves and you know, hills and and all of that she doesn't have the beauty of the curves she is you know a lot trimmer so this dress is a size large it's just kind of pinned on her i did try it on myself if you like this garment my recommendation is to size down i bought a size large it is big on me okay so it is made to fit off the shoulder but since Penelope don't have no arms for it to go around, it's just on her shoulder, which is also a nice look. It is a nice light cotton with elastic at the, at the edge of the sleeve and elastic around the neck. There's also elastic in the waist under the belt. The belt is bought, uh, sold separately. The belt did not come with the dress. Now, this is where, this is where it gets sexy, y'all. Right up in here. From the waist all the way to about right here, from the waist here, there are buttons. So, come on up here, Penelope. Come on, son. Come on. You'll see how she just floated tonight. Normally, she act like she can't stand up on her own. Oh, there she goes. All right, so here, there are buttons. One, two, three, four, five, six buttons. So you can open it up maybe wear a pair of leggings or a pair of shorts underneath it let the wind blow just like that boom 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 you know show a little thigh if that's what you want to do you can button it down as much as you need to so if you buttoned it all the way to the last button it would end up like maybe right above your knee right around your knee i'm just gonna lift penelope up a little bit Stand up, Penelope. I mean, 
Yeah. Come on, work with me. All right, so there is where the last button is. This would hit me like right around my knee area, and then you know it's open for the rest of the way, which makes it um, a great dress if you need to be a little bit more modest. Now I can just totally see me rocking this when it gets warm in the summertime, going out to um, a nice spring warm uh, dinner, a warm outdoor dinner. Maybe it's about, how many degrees is it? Maybe about 83 degrees outside and we're just going to eat outside on the little restaurant deck, outdoor dining, and just kind of, you know, cross your leg. But the, not everything, not everything, just a little, just a little, little, little leg show, little skin show, little melanin popping or whatever your skin tone might be. Now, I'm not going to I'm not going to wear it unbuttoned all the way up to here. That's just not my style. But if you want to do that, you certainly can because you're grown. You can do what you want to do. It's just not for me. I'm going to button it down some and just let, you know, right up in here, right up in there. I'm going to let that pow like that. Leave a little mystery. Okay, so this is that dress. It is very long, like it's perfectly long for me. Pair this with, what you wearing this with, Penelope? Well, let's talk about the rest of your outfit. I see how she's trying to be taller than me. Her neck all the way up here, but by my head and stuff. That's why she be thinking she can tell me what to do, but she can't. All right, so we have this uh, paired with a belt. Let me go to the belt for you. This set of belt, it was two belts that came um, together. It came in this dark brown color. Or, mm, this is really not a dark brown. This is like a milk chocolate brown, this one. And it also came with a black one. And it is just a wraparound belt. This, um, it didn't come in any particular size. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like on me. This is the belt. It doesn't have any uh, fixtures or fasteners or anything like that. Again, I wear about a size 11 and a half, size 12. You know, I got a little roundness right here, right up in here. But it just is what it is. It is what it is. I'm still fabulous and great. I can have, you know, some curves right there and still be fantastic. All right, so I'm going to curl this back. Now, this is not a real leather, and so you, I can certainly feel that. I can feel that um, not leather quality when I try to tie it. But for the price point, I'm satisfied and content with it. So here's how the belt looks on me. Here's what it looks like in the back on me. So enough to cross over and then tie again in the front. I got it because the model that was, when I saw this dress, she had that on with the belt in the waist. You can see in the, in the dress that it has the elastic waist. Um, and you probably could wear it just like that. Now, also, I would say about this dress, it has plenty of room up in here, plenty of room in the chest area, a little bit more room, well, actually a lot of bit more room than what I need. But, you know, if you have, if you, if you are well endowed in this area, there is plenty of room up in here, plenty of puff space to fit the girls in there and, you know, give you a little cleavage. Um, not so much for me. I just, my sister's got that gene. I didn't get it. I didn't get that. They got that. All right. So that is that dress. Now the other belt, let me show it to you. It's very similar to the one that I have on. This is the black one. It seems to be a little bit softer. It's a little bit softer to me than this brown one. The brown one is actually a little bit stiff, but the black one, it's just a little bit softer. Let me put it on Penelope because she's so anxious to show y'all her shoes. She got on a choker tonight too. And I'll show you the choker pack that it came out of. So here is the black one. This black one feels a lot better than the brown one. Um, even in the um, quality of the straps, I'll show you the difference in the quality of the tie pieces. So there is the black one on her. I like the black one better. Just the feel, the feel of the black one better. They do have this, this is the underside of it. And it looks the same, however, let me see the brown one. Here on the brown one, one thing that I don't uh, so much like 
it's okay, but you know, it's not a deal breaker. I won't call it a dud, but I'm able to see the, this white, it's not white, but that light, y'all see that little light strip? When you hold it this way, you really can't see it. But when you hold it right there, you can catch a glimpse of the underside of the material, this color right here. Um, not so much on the black and not that it's not there, but I guess it's just maybe put together a little better. That makes this one better for me. And again, this one is a little bit more flexible, but we're not talking about real leather here. So for the price point, it's okay. This is a deal for me. I do like them. I would pair them with this dress or something like it. Let me put this belt back on her. Be still. Be still now. That's how mamas be doing. Be still. What'd I say? Stand up. Stop crying. Y'all mama ain't do that. That was just my mama. Okay. What you crying for? I'm gonna give you something to cry about if you don't stop. Did y'all mama say that? Okay. So, tie that on her. Again, the black one is just a little bit more flexible. Okay, now the shoes that Penelope, oh, let me talk about the, you can barely see it, but she is wearing a choker tonight. It's brown because she had on the brown belt first, and that came out of this package of 60 chokers. Again, it is in the carousel, wherever the carousel may show up for you, and it's a number of colors. So there are some black ones. Of course, if she was going to rock the black belt, then we would change her to the black choker i just thought that these were really cute you know just a little something to accessorize up in there me 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 are y'all with me y'all with me because i don't see i don't see y'all saying anything in the comments but i'm just trusting that y'all paying attention because it's a test at the end of this i'm just kidding all right so several colors um in this 60 pack of chokers my favorite are like this kind that have like the little design not just the straight the straight, um, what is it called? Velvet, not the straight velvet ones. This one right here looks really cute. Let me open it up. This one kind of looks like a, it's long and it kind of ties and hangs instead of just hooking on the back. So this one, you can do some things with it. Let me take the pearls off. Take the pearls off right quick. Thank you so much. So this one, you can, you know. Can you whoa, whoa, whoa? Can you whoa, whoa, whoa? Can you whoa, whoa, whoa? Something like that. Something like that, right? And maybe wear it to the back or something. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna find something to do with this right here. Tie it in a knot. Yeah, tie it in a little knot. And hang it down your back if you're wearing a V-neck. Or, you know, hang it to the front if that's what you want to do. And you can do that because you're grown. You can do what you want to do. You can do what you want to do. This is almost my favorite. Right here, right off the pad. I wonder if I could get away with wearing this as a belt or something. Something. It has a little gold clasp on the end. I like that one. Some others. A blue. A burgundy. Those are velvet. The bric-a-brac kind that look like you go on the edge of a dress. Um, some with some little shimmy shingles hanging off of it. These are all lace. <clears throat> Very thin. It's 60 of them, y'all. 60. The possibilities are endless. Let's see. <clears throat> this one is like a suede, a gray suede. This will look good with some boots that I got upstairs. I'm gonna have to put that together and come back on another live for y'all. All right, this one right here, let me open it up. See what we got for this one. Un momento, un momento, I'm coming, I'm coming. Be a little bit patient, okay? Be a little bit patient, I wanna show it to you. Y'all see I just took it out the pack. I didn't have it open prior to the show. Sometimes I want y'all to see my real reaction. All right, so this one has like a, it's a two piece. So I got the little triangle and the little strap, okay? Let's see if I see any that are more unique. This one has a cross on it. 
So go on and get your praise on. Y'all see the black and gold cross? This one is strings. Mm -hmm. Just a wide variety of options to give you something to do at your neck. Army green to enhance your outfit a little bit. You know, sometimes less is more. Sometimes you just need a little something. I like this one too. Hold on, y'all. I gotta try this one on. Just need a little something to make the neck pop. 60 pieces in one pack. You got options. You don't have to just settle for the one thing. You can make some decisions. Mm-hmm. I like this one. Oh. Now everybody don't like chokers, but I do. I do. I think they are romantic and sexy. That's mm, 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 mm. where I'm going. Yes. With something off shoulder like that right there. Showing off the, the collarbones and the, what is this called? Deca, decollage, deca, deca something. Y'all, what is this called? Tell me. Tell me in the comments. I forget what it's called. And then have on something nice and romantic like that. <sighs> All right. Y'all don't say nothing. Okay. Uh, I'm going to move on. I'm going to move on. I'm going to move on. I got me just fantasizing about where I am. Okay, and then a couple of other more colors in this pack of 60. You can't go wrong. You're going to find something in here that you like. These are the vibrant colors. Yeah, you can't go wrong. Taste the rainbow. Okay, and then in here, now this was a surprise to me. These are, I, I don't know. I don't, I think these are maybe bracelets. I don't know. I wasn't prepared for this. Maybe I didn't read the whole listing um, fully. This is something, this is not my style right here. This looks like toys to me. And so, you know, I probably wouldn't wear this. It's like the plastic choker. Oh, it's the plastic choker. Okay. So these are also chokers. I don't, I don't, mm -mm. Those are my high school chokers. Yeah, these, this not for me right here. Hold on, you done got caught up in the earring. That's not for me. Mm -mm. No, this this is this is gonna go to my um, executive producers who remain to be children. They children right now. They will probably love this. This 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 not for me. All right, you might like it, and you can wear it if you want to. But it ain't for me. I have to find something else to do with that. But there are several in this packet. Okay. So those are the chokers. That's a deal for me. I do like it. Even if I was just going to wear the one or two that I really like, that long black one tied in a little bow, that other lacy one that, you know, show all of this off. Yes, that's for me. Now, also with this outfit, y'all see she got on the black belt. So she wanted to wear these black Crocs that I ordered. So I don't own any Crocs. I understand that Crocs are super comfortable and, you know, I see them. They're very popular. I don't really like the, the clog Croc. It just is not a cute style to me, okay? It just, I just don't like it. Make your foot look all big and clunky and all that. But I understand that they are very, very comfortable. So when I saw the sandal, now I could do the sandal because it's not, you know, looking all big and clunky and crazy and all of that. I'm just not a Croc girl. I'm just not a croc girl. Everything is not for everybody. Everything not for everybody. You got to learn that lesson too, okay? So they came in that little plastic bag that I just saw hanging on, that you just saw hanging on this. They look like this. I was excited to get these because I understand that crocs are super comfortable. I did not realize that um, it did not have a opening here. You know, it's just the one piece around the ankle, right? And there's nothing wrong with that, okay? However, I have to return these because this is a size nine. I need a nine and a half. This is a size nine W. I need a nine and a half. So when I tried to put this on, I could get my foot in it. It was hard to get like this, I had to like really stretch it. And I know if I, I could get my foot in it and it was okay, but I know if I kept it on for any amount of time, it's gonna cause, this gonna cut my, my foot off. Like this is going to begin to hurt. 
my foot and you know this right here as is between my toe is going to hurt my foot so i do have to return these however i do like the style i think it's a nice little comfortable sandal it is whatever crocs are made out of rubber what are crocs made out of silicone whatever this is made out of i like it it's a cute sandal i could get with this kind of croc i can't get with the clog ones that's that's not for me that's not for me today you see it has the little crop beading pattern on the inside and all of that and i thought that these were a great price for a crock it's just too small sometimes it's just too big sometimes it's just too small so penelope she can wear them for the day here i don't know where you're going but you can you can wear them for a few more minutes but these going back boo these going back she all in her feelings now She'll be okay. All right, get on off the camera. Slide on, slide. Go ahead, go on. There you go. All right, go on. Mm -hmm. Grown folks talking. There you go. All right, so um, if the Crocs were my size, they would definitely be a deal um, per how the bottom of it felt when I put the shoe on. But the rest of it is just too small for my foot. All right, moving on moving on moving on moving on let me put all these put all these back real quick do you mind do you mind if i can clean up just a little teeny bit so i won't be all over the place give me just a minute just a minute stop rushing give me just a minute stay right there stay right there give me just a minute it's a lot of these it's a lot Okay, I got a couple more, a couple of them that fell on the floor. All right, next, this is something that I grabbed for myself. It is the selfie ring light. Because, you know, I understand the secret to taking a great picture is your lighting. And I'm, I'm the worst at lighting. So I picked this up because it was a great price on it. And I need to be selfie ready all the time. So here's what it looks like right out the box you see it has a mirror right there it has a film on it let me go peel that off let's look at the quality of this mirror okay it's looking all right okay oh yeah that's the quality of the mirror there y'all see me in perpetuity see i'm just going back 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 all right so that's the quality of the mirror it has this little clip thing on the back um, it doesn't seem to be very spring loaded, but it's, it's kind of made to hold on by these wires here. And then here is the cellular device. I can make you put your phone down and then you clip it on like, like, like that. Mm -hmm. And then you turn it on like that. Mm -hmm. Get some quality photos going and you get to look at yourself while you're doing it yeah a little selfie mirror just something for the purse you know you out traveling and you gotta take your picture and you need that light to hit you right so this is a deal for me um it's meeting my expectation for right now it's meeting my expectation i haven't tried it out yet i haven't taken a selfie i don't know anything about how lighting is supposed to look but this is doing it for me. It did come with its own charger cord. This is like the Android end of the charger. It's not, you know, iPhone. Y'all you know Apple makes stuff for their products. And then just a standard USB plug in order to charge it. Let me see if it says anything about charging time. A little switch right there on the back. That is how you, oh, and it, look, it, uh, okay, that's that. Do it again, a little bit of light. A little bit more a little bit more three settings very nice okay so multifunctional beauty mirror make you make you good all right a little broken english there it comes in a few colors pink light blue white and black just a little something just a little something to drop in your purse and make sure that you are instagram ready um use a cloth heat steamer on them helps so that they hang flat and straight thank you very much uh mick laughing i don't know if, 
I don't know your first name because it just says D. Thank you very much, D. I shall do that. I shall do that. Someone is at my front door. Um, but y'all see my executive producer trying to sneak by? She got me at the front door. All right. So that's that. Now, let's, I want to go back to a product that I showed on my last live because I have had an opportunity to use this product now and I am feeling good about it. So that is this Clean Skin Club Wipes uh, Facial Cloths, right? So I showed these on my last live and I was telling you, you know, when I do my lives, of course, I put on makeup. I put makeup on and, you know, I put on lashes for y'all so I can look decent and presentable. Not that I don't look decent and presentable without it, but, you know, you got to dress up for the camera, pose for the camera now, click, click. All right, so I had got these. I was excited to get these because, of course, when you wear makeup, you have to wash your face. And I did not like washing, my, washing all of this makeup into my washcloth. I don't mind just washing my face into my washcloth, but washing my makeup into my washcloth, I didn't enjoy that experience. And so when I saw these, these clean towel, all right, she want me to cover up. Let me get close like this. When I saw these clean towel extra large, I went ahead and grabbed these. This is a 50 count box um, on the side. It gives you some information about uh, your your face cloth or your face towel, your washcloth holding bacteria, you know, just hanging in your bathroom. But these are biodegradable and disposable. They come like this and you pull one out and they are guaranteed not to rip or shred. I did try it. I did try it since I talked to you last. I washed my face with it a couple times. My favorite part about this, they are very soft. Now they're not thick like a washcloth, but they get the job done, right? They didn't tear, it didn't shred. And when I got done with it, it went right into the trash can and I could appreciate that the most. Like my face is clean. Um, I have more than one to use. You know, sometimes when you wash your makeup off your face and it's all over the washcloth and then you rinse it out and soap it up and it's still on the washcloth and you rinse it out and soap it up and it's still on the washcloth. I don't have to worry about that with this. One side is textured. The other side is smooth. I soaked up my face like I normally do. I normally, you know, break my face up with um, coconut oil first. This is just my routine. Let me get some beauty hacks like I know what I'm talking about. I normally take some coconut oil and just put it on my face to break all that makeup up. And then, you know, I'll take my washcloth, but now these, now my uh, Clean Skin Club clean towels and soap it up and it comes right on off, including the um, eyeliner for these adhesive liners and also for magnetic line of magnetic lashes that I have worn a couple times. So this is a deal for me. I want to come back and give you my report on that. When I first showed these, I had just gotten them out the box. I had not had an opportunity to use them yet, but I have used them and I do like them. This is a deal for me. I will continue to use them mm -hmm. and put them right in the trash when I'm done. All done. All right. The other thing that I picked up, um, the price at, at the time that I purchased it, it was lower. And, you know, since since last year, when the pandemic just really hit the United States with full force, these things were hard to find. Um, they're a little bit more popular now, but I appreciate being able to shop from my living room and not shop in the store. So when I saw these, I went on and grabbed them. At the time that I got them, they were a little bit lower, but they're still a good price. Um, at the time that I got them, I was able to get three of them. So glad to get them. Um, maybe you need some in your area. Maybe you just need to, to, to stock up to stock up and make sure that you are protecting yourself and protecting your family, protecting your environment and keeping it nice and clean. So, yes, got them, got them. Okay, so I think that was my last uh, item for you for tonight. I do have in the carousel all of my makeup pieces. Sometimes y'all ask about my makeup and all of that. So again, 
Right now, I am just loving this PUR Pure Festival Press Powder with the uh, for my eyes eyeshadow. As you can see in the carousel, it is 12 colors. The colors are very vibrant. I like them. The metallic colors are my are my favorite, not the glitter ones, but the metallic co colors are my favorite. Again, I am wearing the Vaselli Magic eyelashes they are not glue and they are not magnetic they are magic so it's just some kind of self-adhesion formula that is in the eyeliner and in the mascara you just kind of line your eye press the lash up there that's the part that I struggle with the most I'm trying to press it on not that it's hard I just don't know what I'm doing but I don't know I don't got kind of attached to these things look how how, how they go up so really good price on these it's a set of five five lashes five or ten all together but five pairs of lashes and then two um, eyeliners a clear one and a black one and then the tweezers so that you can that part's not for me i'm not i'm not doing that there i'll do it with my hand i'm not doing it with a tool i, I just you got to know yourself you got to know yourself so some things i know i mm -mm, i shouldn't be doing that my makeup my foundation my favorite foundation is the l'oreal uh brand so i've included that included that in the carousel for you wherever the carousel is for you um i've included that just a little stick kind of color on your face with it mm -hmm. get your shade not very expensive at all um in comparison to some other brands but I love the L'Oreal brand it's very light and it's very creamy all right and y'all know that I am in love with this flawless foundation brush I've shown it many times before on my other lives the flawless foundation brush just kind of blends it all in my lip bar lip bar their colors are so 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 vibrant just bam they just when you put it on it's it's just color on another level so i'm loving their brand they are vegan and animal cruelty free this color is hot mama and i like it all right and as you can see i am wearing my ear pods tonight so that i can speak to you when i gotta get penelope dressed and go all the way to the backyard to to talk about you know whatever i got on and all that good stuff okay i want to remind you how delicious the ghoulie gummies are this is a part of my daily staple y'all i take these every day to give me energy and to curb my appetite because i am trying to slim them curves down a little bit i mean i'll rock my curves now don't get me wrong i will rock them but you know some i know it's not wise i know it's not wise for me to hold on to them you gotta use wisdom sometimes you just can't just always do what you want to do sometimes you got to do the stuff that you don't want to do i need to come down on these curves so this is helping me this apple cider vinegar this is a 60 count it is vegan it is also um gluten-free non-gmo and unfiltered and and they are super delicious so i appreciate you for tuning in to deal or dud tonight if you like any of the items that are in my background they are also in the carousel in the carousel in the carousel hello lasagna thank you so much for following um they are in the carousel if you want to take a look at those items my favorite thing back there is my speaker my harman cardone speaker because of the sound quality can we get some turn up can we get a turn up because it's sitting over there but you see we could the executive producer she controlling it from over here making it go up making it go down you can um connect two devices on it at once um it doesn't have to be plugged into the wall you can unplug it take it outside take it wherever you're gonna take it because it can be charged and then i love 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 y'all 
my table right there because it is the lift top table. It's closed right now, but I can lift the table up and take it closer to the chairs. Sometimes when I want to sit over there instead of sitting in my at my desk to get some work done, I can lift the table up. Yes, they are, Lasagna. I love the Goldie Gummies. Um, got several bottles. Y'all see? See right there? Sitting right there. They're right here. I got three upstairs, one in the kitchen, one around the corner, three in a box that I haven't even opened yet. But the um, lift top table, I love the table. It offers storage space. You see the cubby holes right here on the bottom for storage space. And then that top lifts right on up and there's uh, storage under the top. And then, you know, a nice little pour some tea, pour some coffee, glass of wine, eat dinner, lift the top up, bring it right on to you. Okay, so those are my background items. If you're interested in any of those things, I certainly appreciate you for watching another edition of Deal or Dud. I'll be back with you on, it's Tuesday, Thursday night for another episode of Deal or Dud or Deal or Dud or Deal or Dud. So stay tuned. And if you don't mind, please follow. Please follow. Thank you, Lasonya. They in the carousel, girl. They in the carousel. Can't give me no whole lot of compliments. My head of boom, 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 boom. Then I can't walk around the house. All right. Thank y'all so much for watching another episode of Dealer Does. It's been fun. Hope you enjoyed the show and I will see you on Thursday for another episode of Deal or Dud. Have a good night.